Business valuation is defined as the process of determining the business value of a business or company. We asked Michael Fight of A. Newman & Associates a few questions about business valuation services. I've had two businesses myself and uh, it's very important. People don't think about it as far as the process because they're emotionally involved, but you need somebody to give you a third party um, idea of where you stand. Why get a business valuation for a small business? Without it, you, you're gonna have a hard time figuring out long-term plans and you'll have next to no, no chance of selling your business. How do I know if my small business is sellable? The one thing that we use is take 100 businesses. 90 will eventually go close the doors. They'll be out of business. Nine businesses will transition in some way. They will be partnerships, family, something internal. And only one business will truly transfer. And so the definition for us to find out whether or not your business is sellable if you're just trying to figure it out in your head is, can you go away for 30 days and the business run efficiently without you? And if you have a business where you could say yes to that, then you have a sellable business. If I have no immediate plans to sell, when should I get a business valuation? You gotta start planning ahead. You know, three to five years we tell people we can help assess their, their business and give them the, the real, real world value. How long does a business valuation take? Uh, it takes about two months to do it the right way. Uh, we collect all the information for you, we spend time, uh, we go through learning about your company, what you do, asking you questions, um, and we extract all the value out for you. What does goodwill mean in a business valuation? So a lot of people want to know how, to, how you value goodwill. And we 100% can put a value on goodwill. And so going through the valuation process, what you do is you, we find that the appraisal will come back and determine, let's say, that the company is worth $2 million. And we go and we figure out that the assets are 500000 And so what it means is that the hard assets, the tangible assets, are creating the next $1.5 million of value. So that's how you put a number on the, on the intangible goodwill assets. So when people say, well, I don't know how you value the goodwill, your assets are basically producing cash, which therefore determines the goodwill, and that's the value of the business. Last words of advice for having a business valuation? Don't think of yourself as a small business. Think of yourself as a small company.